Hey guys, I'm Kirko. Welcome to Hot Brass Alpha. This is a 2D action strategy game where you play as an elite SWAT operator and you have to master a series of missions while arresting criminals in saving lives. As I said, this is Alpha, or well, this is in open beta right now, and it's gonna be for a bit more. Uh, but otherwise, it's coming later this year on Steam. It's developed by Walk With Kings and published by Fellow Traveler. And yeah, somewhere later this year, it should be on uh, Steam. But right now, I have the ability to play a couple of missions. Uh, this thing is also playable in co-op. Uh, apparently it's uh, really very much recommended if you play like with two people so uh, apparently it's gonna hurt us if you play just alone but hey we're gonna go through some missions just to see how things work how uh, the game plays and then you can guys can figure it out yourself so uh, the first mission over here is just training you know it just throws you through that and it's just training it's it's nothing that amazing the second one is the one we're gonna go in it's it's kind of a training mission but in a real world where you can actually get shot uh i've tried this one i played through this one so i know how it goes but it's gonna give us a uh well a nice i don't know backdrop to just figure out how uh so you guys can see how things work and then we're gonna go for a real mission over here the hammond kidnapping i've not tried this one yet and uh we'll see how it goes but first let's go to real world experience so over here we have the briefing grace hills pd received a call from resident adrian powter who says that he heard at least two unidentified males breaking in and moving throughout the rear of his thompson road townhouse he reports that they have also discussed who should hold a firearm Powder and adult female remain in the front of the house, as they are fearful there may be more perpetrators outside. Operating in a residential area poses high risk to any surrounding citizens. The police have begun currently evacuating neighbors where possible, but you should exercise extreme caution nonetheless. So, these are our objectives. Bring order to chaos. Collect all firearms and evidence. Rescue Adrian Powder. And you have some certain challenges if you do this, like surprise the unarmed hostile. Uh, Detain the armed hostile, that's the one I got, look at that. And time trial completed in one minute, which is definitely not something we're gonna go for, but hey, that's okay. Now, the game tells you, try not to use firearms, you don't wanna kill anybody, you try to go out there and try to, you know, just bring them in alive for questioning and such, and such. So, you know, the gun, your gun is the last uh, resort thing, kind of. So over here in equipment, uh, you can you can change your load up, but since you know I only played like one mission, we don't really have much. So we could go with MP5 or SPAS 12 over here. Uh, guns. This one is still locked. Uh, it it unlocks some stuff in the next mission and such. And we have flashbang, breach and charge, all kind of cool stuff. Some uh, light armor. That's about it. This time, this one is still locked. So, hey, I'm gonna say we're ready. We're gonna start in five. Now, this would be, you know, the place where your friends can play with you. Like, you can have uh, up to four people can be in the same thing. So, you know, up to four police officers. And, you know, as you can guess, more people there are, easier it would be for you to complete a mission successfully. So, uh, just playing alone is gonna be kind of on hard mode. So, this is, you know, still... Uh, Kind of a tutorial-ish first mission, so you're gonna have things pop up like this. So you can see, whatever we move, it gives off like the sound. So we can also, we can press shift and we can walk. It's much, uh, much uh, uh, quieter. And I can also crouch, but when you're crouch, you kind of hide behind things. And it's harder to see, but you're also very, very stealthy. So if you press tab, we hold tab, we can see our objectives. This is the house we're gonna go in. Now, it said there's like two male perpetrators unidentified uh, somewhere in the back and that there might be more. So, we're going to go over here, we're going to look under the door and we get to see the idea how it is. There's a man over here standing, just watching TV, I guess, because that's how it is. So, we're just going to go and we're going to unlock those doors. I'm going to open them and we're going to be like, hey. On your knees, son. On the ground. I'm stuck behind a door, but on your ground. There you go. He's now compliant. We shouted at him. He's now compliant. And now I can, you know, grab him. Grab him, bag him. And this was actually the Adrian Palter. We rescued him. But, you know, you kind of have to bring order to chaos over here. That's... Lady. Let me see your hands. Let me see your hands. 
There you go. So it's easy. These guys, these guys are just civilians. So you Don't come to them, you arrest them because I don't know exactly why. But you know, if you're not quite sure who is who, you wanna you know arrest them. Now we're gonna go quiet, nice and quiet, and we're gonna look throughout the house. So we have a uh, five rooms still, and there's an opening back there. So we're gonna slowly but surely look underneath doors. Under you know, door. we have the machinery to do that. Doesn't seem to be anything in here, so we can just quickly pop through. Nothing over here. All right, let's go back. We can close the doors behind us. This one. Looking under the door. Hello. Now I do know that uh, at least I'm thinking that the the other guys are in these two rooms because that's how it was the first time I checked this. But still, we're gonna we're gonna look some of these through some of these places. So. There you go. Excessive force. Hold F to taste stubborn and hostile characters. Firing upon any unarmed character is considered excessive force. So you definitely don't want to shoot people. So let's look underneath this door. And we do have one of the guys over here. So what are we going to do is instead of just opening the doors, we're going to breach it. We're going to smash it in and we're going to like, show me your hands. See, now he's like, no, I don't want to. So we can go and taste them get tased and now they're like I surrender this one stick we got him boys ladies and gentlemen we got him all right so we know there's one more and they have a firearm so that's gonna be tough cover protects you from weapons fire shouting is still effective from behind cover so this is what we want to do right <clears throat> in here there's gonna be a man with a gun you can see he's holding the gun and it's gonna be dangerous so I'm gonna just quickly sneak in this is this is kind of weird but you can you can be behind a bed and he can't shoot you which is kind of weird I can I can yell at them die pig hello yeah okay don't shoot me there you go he's like I'll throw the gun on the floor there you go we got the firearm we're gonna grab them easy mode easy money all right detain the armed hostile easy now it's on us to go make sure that the house is clear. So we're just gonna look in here. Make sure it's clean. Go in here. And mission complete! Let's go! Easy money. Continue to debriefing. Alright, so this one was, as I said, easy. And I've done it before, so <laughs> nothing crazy over there. Mission complete. We arrested two people. We didn't kill anybody. We didn't... Well, we did injured. Who did we injure? Ourselves? Or them? I don't know. But hey, we got that. We did not surprise the unarmed hostile. I don't know exactly how we do that. Maybe you have to go outside through the window and something like that. And we got some evidence. That was probably the gun. So, hey, we can now continue. So, now we get the Hammond kidnapping. As I said, I've not done this before, but uh, would be nice. So, it looks like uh, first responders interrupted the attempted kidnapping of Web Focus IT Solutions CFO Cheryl Hammond. Now, a hostage situation, shots have been fired, and the suspects aren't responding to negotiators. So this one's gonna be a bit more salty. We might die, and we might have to retry it, but we'll see if I can do it. So let's see what the whole thing over here is. Emergency services received a call at 1820 from one Sammy Martinez at the Web Focus ID Solutions in Carroll. He reported two armed men attempting to kidnap the company CFO, Cheryl Hammond. Local police have attempted to make contact, but so far the suspects have been unreceptive. We have at least four confirmed hostiles. Okay. Mr. Martinez, who is still in contact with the police, also reported a weapons fire from the basement. The company's security firm has confirmed two guards on duty and we believe them to have been involved in an altercation with the assailants. They'll be entering the area from the south. While no hostiles have been spotted since they were started by the first responders, proceed with caution. We don't know who we are dealing with here. So, we have at least four confirmed hostiles. And there's been some shooting out here uh, with the guards, potentially. So, we have to bring order to chaos. Basically, just arrest everybody you see. Collect all firearms in evidence. Rescue Sammy Martinez and rescue Cheryl Hammond. All right. So, going dark is cutting the power. Bang for your buck. Stun three tick characters with one flashbang. That's pretty sweet. Uh, attrition trial com complete without using a health station. And complete mission in seven minutes. Probably not gonna happen. So, we have a flashbang. We have, we have things. So, I'm ready. We'll start this. Actually, I have to remember... Uh, 
where do I get weapons? Uh, which which uh, which um, key bindings? <laughs> which weapons? Because <laughs> I don't remember that. Uh, maybe I should know. Maybe I should know that before I started. But uh, I I played the the first tutorial like a week ago and I have forgotten about it now. All right, so we are entering from the south. You said. Let's see this. This is this is pretty big. This is ground floor. Can we go up? Yo, there's five floors. That's something special. So we have a loading bay. Okay, this seems to be what appears like a maybe health station in there. There's the power. So if you can go down below, that would be nice. If you can go around and come through here, it seems like we could come down. But they were shooting in the basement. Ground floor is just a maze of doors. First floor, it's a bunch of offices and such. Seems like that might be the health station as well. Second floor, there seems to be some toilets out there. And a big conference room, maybe. And that's the roof, which is, seems pretty empty. Alright, this is this is interesting, actually. That's us, that's SWAT. So I'm, uh, I'm guessing we have to go this way. We have torch, by the way. T for torch. Hello. So this, we can see through windows. We're gonna just shine our light through windows. Maybe we spot something. I'm guessing there's not gonna be anybody on the, like, the bottom floor. It's my guess. Okay, so we have a door over here. Let's go up the stairs, because I got stuck. It's very, uh, very dark. Okay, so there is something in there. There is something we did spot something out there, but I'm not gonna I'm not gonna go through this. We're gonna go around. We're gonna take this nice and easy. If I can get down there on the loading bay, that would be pretty sweet. I'm also getting stuck behind everything around here. Yeah, if you can uh, if you can go around, it seems like okay. So we have a a dude over here. All right, he's shooting at me. Okay, stop this. Okay, he surrendered. Okay, you know what? If he surrenders, let's go back in there. Who did I get shot? I think I got shot because I'm slow. Excuse me? Am I... No, I wasn't crouched. I'm just very slow right now. I probably got hit. Something like that. Oh, boy. Why are we so slow? This is obnoxious. Can I see my HP or something like that anywhere? Doesn't look like it. Okay, you know what? You are gonna be tased, dude. There better not be any friends you have. Okay. This one stick, you say? Okay, we got one of these men. Good. Um, so, I would still like to go down below and hopefully kill myself. Because I did get shot, I think. I think that's the reason why I'm so slow. I did not... Uh, yeah, I did not press shift to go slowly because it's it's the same speed. Yeah, yeah, I'm bleeding. Look at that. There's blood behind me. Oh boy! You definitely, definitely wanna not get shot next time, maybe. But we can just say we're being sneaky. That's why we're walking so slowly. I don't know if the suspects move around out here if they would respond to like fire and such but I was slightly surprised oh there's another guy over there just you know take it slow if he doesn't oh there's another man he's gonna shoot me run run okay so we have two in here it's pretty pretty impressive okay I want through they're gunned down. Let's see if Don't I can do the same. Put up. Come on. Don't move. Come on. Around. Don't shoot me. Hands in the air. Oh, easy money. Okay. Well, can I get through any of these things? I don't know how to get in there. Well, it says it said there's at least four of them, but that's already three. That's that's quite something. Maybe that would be the guards as well. I still want to go down below, though. I'm just surprised that we have met already so much resistance over here. 
I did not expect that, truth be told. But uh, it's fun. I, I'm really enjoying this because I personally really like 2D games. You know, I grew up in an era that 2D games were the main thing. And any 3D game that started popping up at that point was just an ugly mess of things when you looked at it. So, <laughs> uh, 2D games are really something I enjoy. So, I think we can go left and then left, yeah. Just be careful not to get surprised by, by anything around here. We never know where there might be some suspects uh, around here. Hello, friends. I have arrived. Yeah. Um, there you go. Oh, you're hurting me, he says. Don't be like that. Get me your pistol. This was uh, interesting and easy <laughs> so far. All right. Yeah, better watch your back. Dude, you threw your gun down just by looking at me and hearing me shout so I don't know I wouldn't I wouldn't be that uh, smart about it now I know there's one challenge is um, where is it yeah stun three characters with one flashbang which means there's gotta be more and they're grouping up somewhere it's gotta be okay so down there is the the way to go below which I still kind of want to do okay that's the toilets over here. You think anybody's in the toilets? I doubt it. Contact. Ooh. Stop where you are. Yeah. Hands in the air. Hands up. Stop. Stop. Please, on your knees. Let me see your hands. Woo hoo hoo. Stop. Okay, I'm dead. <laughs> all right, all right. We'll restart. We'll restart. We'll get this. They got an MP5 from that guy. Ugh. That, that's a tough one. That is a tough one. But not getting shot in the first place would, would have been the best idea. Like, truly the best idea. Okay. Well, we're now faster and stuck. Come on. Uh, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try the below approach. We're going to go check that one out. We're going to just go around over here. There's newscasts over here, of course there are. And I'm just gonna take... Like, I'm gonna go way out here. They're not gonna spot me back here, are they? Please, let me cross this, this thing. Thank you. Contact. Yeah, we see these guys. Oh, there's three of them in there now. Okay, so they did... I guess they walk around a bit. Potentially. Okay, let's... Uh, Let's go a bit slow and steady. All right, so what do we do over here? I okay, you press E. Hello. Get down. Okay, you guys Swap. chill. Whoa, 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 whoa. Police. On your knees, police. That guy does not want to go down. I really don't want to shoot you, dude. I did shoot him. Sorry. But, you know, you were shooting at me. And you... Get taste. Yeah. This one did not want to go down easily. You know what? I got shot in the first uh, first part. You? Oh, I'm bleeding. So suspect I did. Spotted. Where? Where did you spot the suspect? I don't know. But I have spotted the suspect somewhere. There's a camera over there. There's a lot of blood down here. Where did we? Spot the suspect. Is this a suspect? Are you a suspect? Are you a suspect? I don't know, man. Oh, it's in here. Let me see your Get down. Hands up. Don't shoot me, dude. Freeze. Okay, he's not going back inside. Police. Hands in the air. Okay, he threw away his MP5. Let's go. And he had a pistol. Dude. You have been hostiled. Okay. Down below. I think this might be a dead body, this white thing over here. Potentially. I'm gonna go... I've got someone. Okay, there's uh, somebody yelling out there. Hey, stop. Whoa! <laughs> what the hell was that? That was nasty. Alright, alright. I'm gonna try this again. This is, this, is, this is shaping up nicely. I like it. 
I do like it. I don't know what exploded there, but did he throw a freaking grenade at me or something like that? I think we're gonna go guns blazing in now. Yeah, I think we're just- I'm just gonna take my MP5 out now and... We're going in there. Alright boys, this is it. This is it. Hands up, hands in the air. Anybody we see now, <clears throat> they go down. Okay, show me if we see something. No? Okay. Show me. Show me. Contact. Where? Down there? That one's down. Alright. That one's down. Okay, excessive force is being used, boys. Evidence secured. Security evidence. Keep moving. This is SWAT. They have killed our SWAT members twice now. <laughs> we're not, uh, we're not going down without a bang. I'm sorry. Yeah, definitely they do switch around between, uh, between attempts, which is great actually. I love that. Okay, so we had boys in here before. We had two first time around, and then three, and there's nobody in here now. Oh, this is really good actually. How about down here? Because you never know what's going to be around. Okay, so there's somebody in here. Yeah, you're dead. I wonder, do we have bullets? Do we run out of bullets? It's a very good question. I mean, I could not be this aggressive as well, but I want to try the aggressive side for once. Just, just because. Okay, there is still that place. We're going to go check this one out. No blind uh, spots left behind or something. Yeah. That's in here. Looking under the door. Check it out. Oh, that's the stairway. Okay. So we'll get back to that. We'll get back to that. Looking under the what do we have over here? Nothing, it seems. Hello. Yes. Looking under door. Down here. Alright, we're we're good. We see outside. Let's see in here. Looking under door. We see some lights over there. Suspect spotted. That's one down. We do have a body over here, I think. Get out. Get out. I know we're gonna be reprimanded for... Oh, did we get bullets? Evidence secured. Or did I reload? I might have reloaded there. I don't know. I was thinking of pressing E, but I might have uh, pressed R. So that's okay. Okay, that was... That's all secured, right? We have that place still to go to check out. So I'm gonna go check that one out. Yeah, this is now SWAT team in action, boys. If you can't do it safe, you do it with, uh, I don't know, with force. Uh, actually, I do love the idea of doing all this safe. If I was doing this really proper, I would want to go through all of these without actually uh, shooting anybody, for sure. I think it would be a lot more fun, but just for the sake of actually doing something this is up right so we then be down i want to try this okay that one's down yeah in the end i'm just gonna <laughs> end up shooting somebody that okay you i'm not shooting you you should be fine we're gonna go tase you there you go yeah, surrender, son. That's that's a lot more than just four people out here, okay? And if you say shit, cops or die, pig, there's a dead person in there as well now. You get shot just the way it is. Now we did get destroyed over here last time. It felt like somebody threw a grenade or there was something very explosive out here. Evidence secured. Okay. Let's see. See what we got out here. Anybody? Contact. Okay, one shot, one kill. Okay, that's I guess the healing station. Evidence secure. There's a there's an achievement or something like that to not for not using it, and we did not get hurt anyway. And we're gonna go in there just check that thing out. Why are these guys red and these guys are different color? I don't know. That's a very good question. They may be different dead or something. Oh, are we? Oh, we're leaving bloody foot footprints. That's so amazing. I love that. 
Let's go uh, take down the power, maybe. Actually, you know what? Let's be safe. Look under the door. Doesn't seem to be anybody in here. Unlock this. Hello. Anybody? No. So... Close this thing. So there's this power thing. Can we do anything with it? Oh, we did it, boys. I think we took down the power. Let's go. That's perfect. Alright, we're going up. Yeah, it's very dark now. So our torch is the only thing, really. So we're in the first floor now. Let's take a look. So there's the healing station, and we do have a lot over here. Alright, let's pop in here. Okay, so there's a man here. There's gonna be a man over there, probably, because there's lights here. Okay, let's do this. There's gotta be somewhere. Okay, that one's down as well. Pop, pop. Pop, pop, and you got them. We're gonna go through the cubicles slightly later. Potentially. That's a man down. I'm gonna end up shooting... A person I'm supposed to rescue, probably. We see nobody out here. Suspect spotted. Where? Up there, I think. There's like two of them. Okay, that one's down. Okay, yeah, we can reload. Nice, nice and easy. Okay, let's go through these. Just checking out, you know, check out the, the back corners and such. Can't leave any suspects behind our ass. They're gonna come and they're gonna shoot us, you know. This is, this is, uh, this is teamwork, boys. Teamwork, and I'm just alone. Yeah, I don't think that's you know very smart. You just, just put one SWAT team guy in here to do this on his own. Yeah, really, really not smart. That's why you're supposed to play this in co-op. And I have a feeling this would be very, very fun in co-op. And I'm looking forward to doing that. Thank, thank you. Evidence. There's the healing item that we are not gonna pick up. But if you have to go back, then we have a bunch of healing items. One here and one down below. If we if we get injured, we can always pop back. I'm gonna go through your blood so I can leave some more bloody footprints. It's just awesome when you can do that. It is very dark out here. Okay, so that's the whole floor cleared out. Okay, not that many out here. No MP5 boys. We're gonna we're gonna just go and uh, go upstairs. This is this is not how it's supposed to be done, <laughs> but we did it. All right, up, up we go. All right, all right. Second floor, we have this, and then we have roof still. Let's pop on the roof first. Can we go here on the roof? No, you go on the roof somewhere else. Cause the entrance is like here. We'll see about that. Anyway, let's. Uh... Under the door. Okay, so there's a uh, there's a guy right here. Yeah, you're not using that shotgun on me, dude. That looking under the door is really good, by the way. Okay. Let's go through this main area first, maybe. Nice and easy. Very loud. I know, we're making noises. So there's still two hostages somewhere. I'm, I'm stuck, please. Not like that. Hello. Empty? Empty. That's good. Let's look Looking beneath over door. here. Contact. Okay, so we have somebody over there. More than one somebody. I think this is where we have the hostage situation going on. You're down. I think I got shot. Oh, I can't go through this. Uh, yes, I can. I can jump across. Hello. Stop where you are. Police, on your knees. Thank you. I did not want to shoot you. Okay, so this got to be one of the hostages. Right? Probably? It's not letting me know that we saved somebody. But, uh, get me the guns. I forgot it. We can jump over this. Let's go into the toilets. Nobody in here, huh? I've got oh, you... You nasty. You went to take a shit. Did you? Almost got me there. 
All right, let's pick the lock. And that should be clear. Okay. Good stuff. Good stuff. So we have you over here. How are we looking? Still a bit more. We have to go on the roof as well. All right, just got to remember that I can jump over these things. I kind of forgot about that until I really needed it. <laughs> So I'm guessing there's got to be something over here. Okay, so that would be the roof access. Okay. I broke the glass over there. There's somebody over there, but I don't see if... They're definitely hostile. There's somebody over on that side as well. Okay, civilians? You guys civilians? Okay, perfect. This they might be our hostages as well. As well. Don't give me that. Okay. I have been hurt, I'm pretty sure. But. But, let's do this. So there's somebody out there that I can't see. And we can't get in here? Um, how do we get in here? There's the door. Okay. We have the door over here. Let's... Scouting on, your door. Scouting on the door. There is somebody over there. I just don't know who. So we're gonna crouch down. We're gonna... Unlocking door. Unlock the door nice and easy. Who are you? Hands in the air. Stop. Okay, Stop. You, you got a gun. You gotta go. Got a gun, you gotta go. Just the way it is. Okay. I still have this room. This one seems to be empty. Still have this room and we have the roof. Okay. Looking under door. Show me. Found someone here. Okay. Stop. You. Don't move. Yeah, you should be probably one of the... Uh, that's probably the guy that called us. Something like that. He's hiding in here, in this room? Maybe not. Okay, maybe I shot them. So we got this floor. Huh, why is this one green? And the first floor is blue. There's something left in the first floor, you say? We're gonna have to go double check that. It's probably how it is. Operator infraction is what we did, apparently. I might have used excessive force or something like that, or shot somebody I wasn't supposed to shoot. Contact. Ready? Shit. Shit cops, they say. I probably shot at too many people. You know? I think uh, I was supposed to be like, uh, don't shoot at them until they shoot at you. But hey, I just wanted to do this, okay? Don't you dare. See, they shot at me. Okay. We're still gonna go uh, back to that first floor. Yeah, that's all empty. Four, at least four people in my ass. There's like a hundred of them. How are you supposed to do this? Look at how many there are. I'm bleeding. I'm slow. Which is unfortunate. But I'd, uh, at this point, I don't think I want to go grab the med kits. Just so we can do the challenge. You know? Okay, so that one's green as well. So we have to go down to the first floor. That one seems to still have something for us. Okay. Just don't get yourself killed right now. That's that's the only thing I can say. Just don't get yourself killed. Also, sprinting might uh, cause some noise. So maybe not that good of an idea. But hey, we, we should be fine, right? We're going down. This floor is still blue. Okay. Let's see. What did I miss? What did I miss out here? I thought I checked it all all these cubicles but maybe there's somebody hiding somewhere it's a very good question or did I leave some evidence behind that's a potential thing so okay fair enough let me go check all of these places I don't know man uh, let's go hmm that one is still red. Maybe that one still has something on them. Let's go check that. Keep on sprinting because why not? I don't think there should be anybody around here. 
Do you have anything on you? Do you have anything around? I don't think there's anything around here. Okay. No, some of these are red, some of them are not. So that's that's not it. Fair enough. What did we not check then? Hmm. Don't know. Really don't know. But uh, sure, I'm gonna go check some more stuff. Uh, potentially we've not been in this cubicle section over here. Maybe. Hello? Anybody? Anybody? I got someone. Oh, I almost shot at them. But I did not have any bull Let bullets. Come on. Hand. Okay, you know what? Okay, there you go. Don't move. Perfect. This should be the last one. Right? Yeah, mission failed. <laughs> Continue the briefing. We probably use excessive force, but hey. Well, <laughs> we did it. Kinda. Let me see. So, uh, arrests, one out of five. Infraction free, no unjustified violence. That's something we failed. All challenges complete, we failed. No casualties. <laughs> 13 justified kills, 11 unjustified kills? Wow, okay. 24 excessive force. All of these were excessive force. One injury, 32 evidence reported. Well, I mean, I did all of this, but we did too much stuff. So, you know, we didn't finish any challenges because we failed the mission, unfortunately. But hey, <laughs> now you get to see how not to play Hot Brass. <laughs> but yeah, there's just so many of this, uh, these enemies out there that you really kind of need a friend to do this properly, I think. In any case, for now, thank you, buddy, for watching. I do hope you enjoyed this episode. Uh, and go check out Hot Brass on Steam. It's coming later this year and i might revisit it whenever it's out proper maybe with a friend then we'll see for now thank you buddy for watching hope you enjoyed it click the notification bell below if you want to see more from me and i'll see you guys next time Kirk around.